So this is according to Reality Blurb. So Real Housewives of Miami, Anna um, Keen Cocase, hope I pronounced her name correctly. Sorry if I didn't, guys. Shuts down Adriana's claims of having a conversation about Alexia's husband, Todd, Todd's finances with her, and suggests Alexia is protesting too much. Now, the reason why this is important is because Adriana came on the show basically saying, Anna came to me with all this information about Todd and Alexia's finances. I was thinking that, oh, so this is Anna and Adriana coming together to take down Alexia. Anna wants to be back on the show. Adriana is holding a grudge against Alexia. She's very jealous of her. She was done dirty last season. She's on some get back. But the fact that Anna is now coming out and saying this never happened, who do we believe? Let's go through the article and let's read her post and then we can discuss who do we believe, okay? So Anna took to her Instagram story on Thursday to address her recent on-screen drama with Alexia and Todd after Adriana suggested she had informed her about the couple's alleged financial troubles on Wednesday's episode of The Real Housewives of Miami. Anna denied discussing Todd's finances while also suggesting that when it came came to the forced move that, that when it came to their forced move from their 10,000 square foot rental, Alexia was protesting too much. Now, this is what's on the screen. This is a screenshot of Anna's Instagram story. She says, my ears are ringing. So here's what I have to say about that, Anna wrote on December 29th. I spent decades practicing transactional real estate law. Enough to know the difference between a lender and a realtor. I believe Todd is the latter. Never discussed his finances or how interest rates affect his earning potential with, uh, with Adriana, period. That being said, she added, the woman Alexia does protest to much. So she's basically coming out and saying, Adrian is lying. We never had that conversation. I never said anything about Todd and Alexia's finances. But then she threw in that shade to be like, but then again, Alexia is protesting too much. So maybe what she said was true, but I'm not the one who said it. So she's trying to throw shade at Alexia, throw her under the bus and Todd while trying to keep her hands clean. You see? So during Wednesday's episode of Real Housewives of Miami, Adriana made the claim amid a car ride with Julia. A little bird told me something in relation to Alexia and Todd, said that they're having some financial issues, Adriana alleged. Then, after naming Anna in a confessional, Adriana told Julia she was besties with Alexia and Maricel, and then they had a huge fight. That friendship ended. So Anna said that because, you know, interest rates are high and Todd's business is about loaning, Todd's business is not doing that well. So Anna said that they are going to have to break the lease on their apartment and leave that place and find another place that's maybe less expensive, she added. Speaking to people last month, Alexia denied reports of financial hardships and blamed the false, mover, the false rumors on Adriana. They sold our unit, unfortunately, so we had 30 days. Less than 30 days, actually, to find another place and move out, Alexia explains. That's the thing that sucks about being a renter. It's out of your hands sometimes. Okay, so Alexia is denying the claims that she's having financial issues. Now, this is the thing, guys. This is where I land on it and put it down below. I want to see what you guys think about this. I think that Anna is lying. In my opinion, alleged. This is just my opinion. I do think that Anna and Adriana had a private behind-the-scenes conversation where Anna was saying that Alexia and Todd were broke, they were having financial problems, his business wasn't going good, that's why they had to break the lease, and that's why he had they had to get out of the apartment. Now, I also think that in all businesses, any industry, and as we know, Anna and Todd work in this very similar industry in like real estate, lending, all of that stuff, relationships matter. I think the reason why Anna is now backtracking and saying that Adriana is lying is because she does not want her personal relationships and business contacts to suffer for being the source of this type of gossip when it comes to business and finances. You know what I'm saying? Hi, Tay Tay. Tay, this is Happy New Year, Candy. Happy New Year, Tay Tay. Do you see what I'm saying? So I think that Anna is trying to cover her tracks. That's what I think is going on here.
But I want to know what you guys think. Put it down below. Do you think that Adriana made it up and she's lying just to get back at Ale- just to get back at Alexia? Or do you think that Anna is the one who was lying because she's trying to cover her tracks and not get into trouble with her real estate and business contacts? So put it down below and let me know what you guys think. And be sure to like, subscribe, and share. All right. So with that, let's move on to – oh, and the last thing I want to say about Adriana is I think that she's having Lisa's back. Not so much because she likes Lisa like that, but it's to spite Alexia. Because 